my amazing, beautiful fans out there. It is 10.34, and I always feel like I make videos very, very late at night, but I have to get right into this video. Um, this video is frequently asked questions that I get, and I wrote all the frequently asked questions that I get in this notebook, which is sexy because it has one direction on it. And I guess I'll just get started. Okay, so the first frequently asked question, which is kind of creepy if you ask me, and the first question I usually get asked is, who's Tom? Um... Tom is this kid, and I've known him since fifth grade, and he's probably watching this, so I, um, we aren't really friends, um, per se, uh, he's, he, he has his moments, like, he bought me flowers once, which was before school ended, which was really a sweet gesture, so thank you if he's watching this. Tom is a kid in my videos, and he goes to my school, and I've known him for a few years. This question hits some places. It says, first time he self-harmed. Uh, the first time I self-harmed, I was... 10? Yeah, 10. And I was going through a lot of things. I was being bullied. Um, and I was just upset 24-7. My sister, my stepdad left. Um... California kind of Hill from the age 10. When you started liking makeup, I started liking makeup about two to three years ago. Uh, I remember having this friend, I didn't have names, but she was always really, really mean to me. And, like, she would call me ugly and stuff, so I don't know, I feel like I needed makeup back then. To this day, I still feel like I need it. So, when did you start YouTube? I started YouTube October, no, December 25th, 2010, which was Christmas of 2010. Um, I was like 11, I think I was, and I got my laptop that day, my black laptop that day, I'm like, okay, I want to try this. I made simple, non-faith videos because I didn't have a camera, I eventually went on a, bo a webcam, which I do not have anymore, but uh, my username was page86795 when I first started. Next question is, are you single? Um, yes, I am single, and I have been single for a little while, um, so yeah. Okay, the next question is, ever dated a girl? Yes. Two. This question I don't like. And the question was, Amber or Amanda? And, as you guys both mentioned, you guys have both met Amber and you guys have both met Amanda. And I've known Amber since sixth grade and I've met Amanda this year, but Amanda, me and Amanda are really, really close. Me and Amber are really, really close. I can't say, oh. Has definitely Amber or definitely Amanda. I can't choose between Amber, Amber or Amanda. The next, the next question is, are you depressed? I wouldn't... Like, if you asked me, I would not call myself depressed. I have a moment where I'm upset. And... Stuff, but I've never really been diagnosed with depressed, depre depression. Or nobody ever told me. Like, I haven't... Last time, I haven't been to therapy since January, and I just don't call myself depressed. The next question is, I'm sorry they haven't put on here, that says you still cut. Uh, I do. I haven't in a little bit less, no, a little bit either, a little bit less than a week. Who is my inspiration? My inspiration is Demi Lovato, um, and my inspiration is Demi Lovato for some obvious reasons. Um, most of you guys will know this. Uh, but I just find her story really, really inspiring and how, even after it all, she still looks at the world with hope. My grade, I will be ninth grade in September. So I will be a freshman in high school. Woo! -hoo. Favorite makeup brand? My favorite makeup brand is a MAC, but I don't own much for MAC. MAC or like Revlon or like. I have a Revlon, I don't know. I have a lot of LA color stuff, but I don't really like that makeup. Well, it depends on like what product. Like right now, I think I'm wearing Revlon, no. Maybelline. And I like it, but it depends on like certain lips. Like it depends on favorite makeup brand for lipstick or makeup brand for that. And it's tied along with the like question, which is the least favorite makeup brand, depends on the product from the makeup brand. My favorite type of animal, my favorite type of animal is a uh, cat because as you can tell I have three cats and I absolutely love cats, so 
Good question, asked me what happened to Buddy. Uh, I did have a rabbit named Buddy. He died May 31st. And I did make a video uh, the day he died. I was kind of in hysterics. Uh, but I'll tell you, he had a heat stroke. He died a heat stroke um, from the sun. Don't want to get Are you still getting a hamster? Yes, I am still getting a hamster. I'm getting him July 13th, which is actually not the Saturday, but next Saturday. My goal in life, I mentioned my, my shoulder. My goal in life is to make people happy. Um, and be happy myself, and I want to be a therapist when I grow up because I want to help people. Though I never really got helped. And I want to be known. I think you mentioned this movie. I don't know if I did, but at the end, Frank said she wants to be known after she goes. She wants to keep on living after she dies. I do too. I want to be known even after I die. I want to be talked about. So you want to know my age, I'm 14, my favorite color is blue, and my state is Massachusetts, but I say, and I honestly hate Massachusetts. I hate it. My aunt moved to Colorado, I'm like, take me with you! Got asked, do I like YouTube? Um, I made a video recently saying I was gonna quit YouTube, I'm still thinking about it, I'm not sure yet. So I'm making as much videos as I can before I come to a decision of quitting. Um, that would hand finish on that one. Uh, but I guess it's okay. Like it's nice to communicate with people because I talk about the self harm. I talk about things I can't talk about with other people. So I, don't, I guess I like it. Favorite band? Obviously, my favorite band is One Direction. But I also like Five Seconds of Summer. If you guys know who Five Seconds of Summer is, it's a band that they went on tour with One Direction. My favorite singer is Simon for Demi Lovato, Ollie Murs, Ed Sheeran. Cheryl Lloyd, Rita Ora, I can, I can just go on and on and on. For some reason, people like, I like to refer some, some people who still want to talk about Johnny. Uh, the next question is, did Johnny know about yourself harming? Johnny did know. And he was probably the sweetest person. He acted so sweet. He was always there for me when I needed him, and it was, it was nice to have someone there for you for once. Um, but it was nice. He, he did know. He didn't know.